the two stone glitch is still working guys i'm going to be showing you how to do that in this video it's exactly the same as it was before but if you've forgotten or you've never heard of it for some reason you've been living under a rock i'm going to be explaining to you and um, refreshing your memory on this one so let's go ahead and begin with that one now also last night's stream was absolutely fantastic we had some mad donations for the raising of a giveaway i gave away two copies of black ops 6 so i'm going to be doing another giveaway soon just make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on that one as well and let's take a quick look at my sponsor for this video mitch cactus because he offers a range of services for modern warfare 3 including camos camos and more camos for both modern warfare 3 and modern warfare 2 he's also got pre-made accounts for modern warfare 3 and then also zombie schematics boost you got the nuke skin boost over 10,000 customer reviews we can check out yourself go ahead and use code joey for five percent off links in the description and now let's get back to the video okay guys so first of all you're gonna need the bad signal mission equipped so go ahead and equip that bad boy and then go ahead to your inventory and put the uh items that you want to duplicate put them all in the inventory and go ahead and start a game of modern warfare 3 zombies now once you're in the game the first thing you're going to do is get some money because you need at least three thousand dollars two thousand of that is going to go to a tombstone so go ahead and buy a tombstone and then also one thousand to activate the portal now once you got all that stuff you're going to go straight to this location on the map right here so what you're going to do is come to this location in the building come up the stairs and put in the code i'm showing you on screen right now one two three Go ahead and put that code in. Now activate the portal with $1,000 and follow me. Go ahead all the way down to this bad signal portal right over here. And you're going to activate that portal. Now you're going to run back all the way. Unless you've got a Scorcher. Obviously, if you use a Scorcher, it's going to be a lot faster. So use that bad boy if you've got one. And if you've got stamina up, it's going to make it very easy for you. So make sure you've got stamina up. Run all the way through this location where I'm showing you here. Just follow me where I go. Go back to the portal. Enter the portal and come straight over here to the edge of the beach. Make sure you're looking at the time on the left-hand side. Once that hits it's three seconds you're going to go to the map and hold triangle if you're on playstation or y on xbox and accept yes now it's going to time i appear on the screen hover over at the end section and once it goes from seven seconds to six seconds you're going to walk out of bounds and that is exactly what you need to do that's all you need to do but there's one more step if it's done correctly the portal is going to put you through and take you to the eliminated screen now once it's on the eliminated screen you're going to go ahead and wait for the black screen to appear once it goes black on any console pc quit the application go ahead and quit it and now when you return to zombies you're going to see you have all your items there still unequip them into the stash go back into the game and got all your items again from the tombstone and then repeat keep on doing this you're going to duplicate your items but this is very useful because you don't have to wait for the two-day cooldown on all your schematics. Thank you for watching. Drop a like and subscribe. See you guys tomorrow with another video.